words in the poem, they are basically guiding people into embodied oneness, into a sense that they're one with everything, with all of life. And if that happens and they feel then suddenly still and relaxed or even ecstatic or whatever their, their response is that happens, that I could imagine that then it's just amazing to then transition from that into the contemplation of, of your painting, you know, into that meditation of your painting. Yeah, because the way I perceive it is it's happening in the words and the poetry and it's happening with the painting is this quieting everything down, you know, stopping that, what we call in the States, the monkey mind and, and allowing that connection to happen, that mm. portal to, to open. And even if it's for you know, the few minutes it takes to read the poem or the 11 minutes it takes to sit in meditation, so much can happen for a person in that time. But I, I found it also really interesting to meditate on the painting with the poem, you know, because you had the image of the painting with the poem. And it's really interesting to actually see what happens in combination, you know? Do you feel That's we could invite people to keep the eyes open or have them closed as they feel? Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. Because, you know, it, it was interesting because I I did feel very called to just have the artwork there in case somebody, oh. you know, did have their eyes open. And that, for me, just because um, I'm such a visual person that when I'm listening to something that I know I really, really want to take deeply in, I close my eyes. So, yeah, let's leave it whatever the person feels to do, or maybe listen to it once with your eyes open and once with your eyes closed, but the artwork is there regardless. So I think that's, that's lovely. Yeah. Yeah. So and we'll be listening to me reciting the poem and then we'll immediately go into an open eyes meditation with the artwork and the artwork is channeled artwork. I call it meta art and it's so I basically um, go into you know a higher state of consciousness and I call in whatever it is this particular painting is peace and so I just sit in that space and that energy of peace and I allow that to channel through into the painting and what I find is that the the longer the paintings in existence the more people that meditate on it it's charged with peace but it becomes even more and more charged excited to to invite everyone now into this process with us. And, um, and yeah, and I want to say how honored I am and thank you so much for allowing this poem to come through you and, and to the world. Oh, thank you. And vice versa for the beautiful painting and for this lovely opportunity to collaborate in such a incredibly beautiful and very unusual, unique way. Wonderful. Well, let's mm. do it. <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> Meta art is a channeled painting. This ocular meditation or eyes open gazing meditation is done simply by letting your eyes settle on one spot, typically in the center, wherever your eye is drawn to. Find that spot and then relax your gaze. As you breathe in, breathe in peace. And as you breathe out, breathe out peace. Connect with the art and allow peace to grow within you. Allow it to fill every cell of your body. One inexplicable universe. One starlit endless sky. One green and blue planet amongst countless others. One profound mystery. As one you dance. As one you dance. As one deep vast ocean all around. As one body of earth and rock and fire and bones and flesh and hair. One air, one water, one wind, one breath. One sun, one moon, one sound, one silence, 
one intricate and incomprehensible web of particles and waves, atoms and cells and empty space, one gravity, one light, one day, one night. One inexplicable universe, one magnificent and magical organism of aliveness in forever changing forms of wondrousness, one love, one heart, one true happiness shining in all eyes as one you dance, as one you dance. The one pain of all the horrors, the one pain of all the fake divisions, the one pain of all ideas of I and me and mine, one pain of all the I am good and you are bad perceptions, one pain of all the fears of the so-called other, one pain of all the love destructive forces, one pain of all the unnecessary sufferings, as one you dance as one, as one responsibility, as one heart, as one love, one love, one love, and as one colorful and bright and shining humanity.
Thank you for joining us with the Caravan of Unity 2020 and a universal prayer for peace.